Hey y'all, welcome back to my channel. Um, today's video is going to be actually I'm not even gonna say it yet. Let's just talk about something. You know how like people who have like darker pigment or like who have melanated skin when we shave like the area that we're shaving gets dark for example underarms so i was on instagram scrolling and i kept coming across this cream and i'm like maybe this is a sign that i should just buy it because I have pretty dark underarms and I hate them. I think it's so ugly. So, and I, I was looking for like different like remedies or different products that I could use. I cannot stand my dark underarms and I was looking for remedies and things to try to try to make them lighter. I even tried um, this scrub from Ancient Cosmetics that I saw. It was like a lemon and turmeric scrub and I tried it and I didn't feel like it really did anything. So I ended up buying this. And this is what I was seeing. Sorry, it's a little bright. The sun, honey. <laughs> Can you see it? Hold on. Okay, so it's the original underarm brightening cream. And I kept seeing this all over the place on Instagram. And I was like, you know what? Let me give it a try. So it says you apply to underarms morning and evening. So twice a day. And it naturally brightens with vitamin C and yuva ursi extract. The brand is called Forgotten Skincare. And the website is ForgottenSkincare.com. Or the Instagram is at Forgotten Skincare. This is for external use only, and you do not apply it to broken skin. Do not use if you are pregnant or breastfeeding. So, I've been using this for maybe about a month, a month and a half. Um, I will insert over here how my underarms looked before I started. I just wanted to do like a halfway update. Um, you are supposed to use this for three months to really see the full results, but I'll probably just use it until I finish. Like, um, so you are supposed to only apply a dime amount. Um, since you guys, I'll, I'll show you what, it, what I looked like a month ago and I'll show you what I look like now. I don't have anything on right now. Um, there's no deodorant know anything not even this is on there and honestly i do feel like it is improving i do it looks so good it doesn't even look as bad like let me show you the other one this one might be a little bit worse than the first under pit but y'all see where it's dark like right here a little here but it's not it's not looking as bad as it was so this is how you apply you, a little goes a long way so all you need is like a dime size amount like that much that's it even even this might even be too much but you just go like this all over your underarm So, yes, I applied it to both underarms and it goes on clear. You can't see it. And it has a really nice lemon scent to it. It smells good. It smells good. Um, even in the instruction, it was saying that you can almost wear this alone, like without deodorant because it kind of like, I guess, deodorizes or 
does something to your sweat. But for me, I've tried that and it, no, I, I need to use deodorant after this. <laughs> so yeah, I guess I sweat too much or I don't know, but I cannot wear this alone. If you're not a big sweater, you probably can just go with just this and you might be all right. But yes, girls. So if you have any troubles with dark underarms and you're looking to try something, maybe you should give this a try. I don't know. It may or may not work for you, but I feel like it's doing something for me. And I'm excited because when you be taking them selfies or taking pictures with your arms up and get underarm just to be looking dark, it just kills the picture. Like, I've seen people put emojis over their underarms, like, <laughs> just because they don't want their underarms to show. But you know what I'm talking about. So, that's it for this review. I just wanted to show y'all something real quick. Show y'all this. I don't know why it looks so blurry. It's killing me. That's the sun. It's focusing on me. That's why. <laughs> but yeah. Um, let me see the ingredients. So, I wish I still had the um, pamphlet and everything that came with it. But I've already had this for a month. Sorry guys, so I don't really know what's in this, but I will look it up and put it in the description below, just in case you're wondering what this is made of. Um, let's see. Oh, it would expire and so it has about two years shelf life, which is cool. Um, so yeah. I will do another update once the three month mark hits to show you guys if it like completely got rid of it or to show y'all like if it got even lighter than what it is right now i will keep you guys updated for sure so um don't forget to like subscribe and comment and share this video with all your friends and family and stay tuned for the update in about a month or so have a good day. Bye-bye.